everyone just want to give you a quick update this is selena at amore fabrics this is a crafty channel <clears throat> if you might just go ahead and thumbs up and subscribe um, i'm just showing what's the new uh, stock that i just got in the mail today um, for the shop um, i did get the adubita like scarves from india and um, this time I, I had ordered by color scheme. So it's just like all blues, oranges, pinks, purples, and it worked out a lot better. Otherwise I'd get a bunch of scarves and I didn't know what colors and I needed certain colors. Seems like blues are the best, or I should say the most popular. Um, and then it's purples and then pinks and thereafter. Um, so I was going to show you really quick what it looks like when I first get it in the mail. And then um, I go through it and I examine them. And I just wanted to give you guys an update on a stock. I'm very excited. I'll make you guys a little dizzy here. Uh, up here you can see I have an assembly line of how I do it. I separate them by colors. And then I cut them into their, their packs. And then we have scrap packs as you can see here. Right now, I've been putting them in the uh, <laughs> stamp uh, bins right now. So it looks like we're newly going to have some purples in the shop that are scrap packs. They are usually 5 by 7 bags filled. Right now, I'm just filling them up. As you guys see, i got a mess going on here. I am fueled by Diet Coke. No, I'm not sponsored by them, but I drink it a lot. So right now, today, I'm just stocking greens and reds. And they're, they're going to be packed. They're going to be all kinds of different colors. I just just listed the, these two colors in the shop before. I had, I think, just basic uh, uh, red, not reds, but pink, blue, yellows, and stuff like that. Um, and then now I'm working on the trims as well. So this is how I do the trim packs, as you guys can see. The trim packs come in 25 6-inch cuts. Um, I don't know how much. I forgot already. But um, And then I package them. So they kind of like in an assembly line. Right now i got to cut all these. Um, look at this one here. So if you order, this will be in the most recent pack. The different kinds of beaded fringe and things like that so you kind of see what's going on so okay run on over I like I said I just stocked red scraps green scraps and uh, I have all these to cut up today and then I got the silks Woo, girls and guys I am busy today so um, like I said I got the purples reds these here are gonna be cut into the ten and a half by ten and a half inch square packs they're ten in a pack I think yeah um, of the, the variety of these colors. So you don't get one alike. And then after I get scraps from those, I kind of put them into their packs. Like I'm still working on, oh, that's right. I do have orange in the shop, but I don't have brown scraps in the shop. So today I will be listing ground, ground, brown scraps as well. Um, and then I have the four and a half inch by four and a half inch square packs. Um, they're going to be ready here too. So they are already cut into the four and a half inch strips. I just got to cut the opposite direction. And they are a 25 pack kind of pack. So as you guys can see here, I got a mess going on. Bring you right back down to the floor without trying to make you dizzy. So I'm really anxious and excited to dig in. And I uh, got a lot of beautiful blues pinks and stuff so truly excited i'll tell you one thing though it is very hard finding purples so i did get a good variety i think it's like a 10 pack of purples this time that was all she can do at this time um so yeah i'm excited all right guys until next time uh check out the shop there's some new stuff going on in there bye